your advice you can give any of the golfers out here that don't have a chance of winning like yourself? Monday was a great pro-am. I mean, I, I think I shot 10 under in the pro-am. I texted my wife and said, this, this place is good. I really like it. She just said, get after it. And I thought, yeah, maybe this golf course kind of suits me. Why not? And I just kind of kept it rolling all week. But it is tough to keep telling yourself at 36 that, you know, my time's coming. Because 36, it, it, it may not be, but I kept practicing, kept working. A little bit surreal, but I think it's going to sink in in a few minutes and uh, it's just a hell of a feeling. Playoff never entered my mind. I, I knew I had a one-shot lead going to 18 and uh, my goal was to make a birdie so that Sung Jae had to make a two. So I was just focused on hitting two good shots and giving myself a decent look. I'm going to celebrate, I'm going to enjoy this a lot and then I'm going to get back to work and see if, uh, see if I can get to where I want to be on the money list. When the community comes out in support, that, that's nice for us to play in front of a bunch of people, but uh, I mean, all we do is show up at our tea time and play, and you don't understand the work that goes in from the tournament director to the sponsors to the staff to the superintendent. I mean, everyone puts in so many hours. Take a step back and think about all the work that those guys put in to make this as good as they can make it. And that showed, I mean, it was, it was first class. I mean, I've played PGA Tour events and this is every bit as good. So they, uh, their hard work definitely paid off because it was a really, really, really good event.